Okay. Let's start with their cloud steppers. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're wearing them. You look adorable. These are so cute. Okay, it's I cannot so stand it right now. I can't. First of all, the goring all the way around the throat so that you can literally pull them on. Second of all, my color, which is dark gray, is giving me massive gray flannel vibes. What you cannot see from where you're sitting is that the gray flannel, which is not flannel, but nonetheless, the gray, has this like orchid pale pink top stitch. Gray so laces with the orchid tint, again, changes with the colors you choose. Outsole that is not annoying optic white, because that would be like, a sports sneaker. This is a fashion street sneaker. And in medium and wides, um, they're called the Breeze Sky. And that upper that looks heathered on Courtney's too, because she's got dark blue, is actually jersey knit. But I don't want to give it all away right now. I want to give um, Miss Amy a chance to tell us about Breeze Sky, because not only are they on a $13 easy pay, but in a second, I have a story to share about why I'm obsessed with these. Okay, girl, you first. I mean, I want to hear your story so badly. I'm chomping at the bit, but I just did want to say the Breeze Sky is the closed toe version of our beloved flip flop. So Sean, it's no surprise you would love it because you said, you know, you love, you're a boots person, but you also like summer shoes. So this is the update to our amazing Breeze C flip flop, but we just put a closed toed version so you could wear that comfort of a flip-flop all year round um black is on fire that's the third color we didn't tell you about and look at the outsole court it's got like a gray outsole so charcoal mm -hmm. and black these are high level chic new york city like awesome okay you guys want to hear my story yeah um yeah it's not really that great, but I will say I had kind of a fashion epiphany the other day mm -hmm. because I saw something now that I want to completely steal and start like wearing. So now that we're all getting out of pandemic mode and out of PJs and like back to normal clothing, I saw a couple celebrities. Mm -hmm. They were wearing, which I'm sure you're already doing this, trouser pants mm -hmm. and a blazer mm -hmm. or like even mm -hmm. like a suit, like a two piece set mm -hmm. with street sneakers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. which was like a fresh aha for me yeah. because I assumed like a suit or a tra like a nice right. trouser pant you would wear with like a beautiful heel. Well, you can, but apparently that's certainly not the only thing you can do with it because now that we're all still in comfort footwear mode and we, yeah, we want to get into that wardrobe that's like a little more fun than PJs, people are pairing their street sneakers with like their suits and their blazers and their trouser pants and their like wovens. And I just think that is so cool because it's like shabby meets chic. So that is why I love these. That know, was, was, you are that right on the story. mark. It's Paris Fashion Week right now. And that seriously is what everyone's yeah. wearing to the shows. Mm -hmm. You're seeing a lot of suiting um, this fall. So lots of blazers, lots of trousers, which is so exciting. But yes, we're like updating it with the beloved sneaker. And this is from our cloud stepper line. So it's so light. It feels like a cloud. It's layers of cushioning working together. But the detail in the comfort is really amazing. You're getting 10 millimeters of underfoot cushioning in a great comfort shoe. You usually have four to five. So we're bringing you double that. And you can see it's, it's just working together. Wow, Rebecca mm. looks so again there's just something about this sneaker and I think you said it right mm -hmm. Sean that street sneaker but it's like not your gym shit well we are really busy we have 400 people waiting to place their orders and I believe a lot of those people are trying to get the black so I would suggest go get the black if you want it, it does have that really cool outsole that's a little bit deeper there's a dark gray in the middle I, I love that if you love winter whites if you wear like ivories mm -hmm. um, black Ooh, leggings that's cute and then the dark blue is just your answer to denim um, I like this one because look fashion sneakers are here to stay obviously but this is giving me 1940s 50s movie star mm -hmm. on the weekend with like a great little you know yep. like biking somewhere fabulous. Yes. Little um, paddle pusher. Yeah, yep. it's it's feminine. It's not like big and bulky, which I like a bulkier sneaker too. But I just think there's something that's so pretty and feminine and like classic about this. Totally agree. Yeah, and it has a, a footbed that is like that fun pop of color. Um, 
it's like they all have these little prints on them, which are so cute. This is a style that you're going to wear all season long, and it's going to give you great grip and traction. And remember, if you know what I'm talking yeah, about, yeah, I mean the Breeze, the breeze Sky, flop. sister to yeah. the Breeze C, which I mean exactly. Breeze C. How many like I? How many of those thong sandals do you guys sell every year? We sell 2.3 million. <laughs> of like, this flip-flop think about and that. this is the first season we're like let's make a closed toe version like what took us so long like i could easily like, this could have launched as a today's special value seriously yeah it should mm -hmm. be a tsv i'm telling you it is ridiculously comfortable that removable foam footbed with all the cushioning the the mm -hmm. upper jersey knit and then all of that goring it almost feels like a little silky on your feet. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but like I am digging these. Well, so. don't be sad to put your Breeze C away because now right. you can get the Breeze Sky. I mean, that is a huge deal. Um, don't wait on the black, dark gray. I think that is so cute. I love that on you. And that to me, I know you don't wear wool, right? Don't you have a little sensitivity to wool? I do. To me, this looks like wool, but it's not. That was it does. Um, and then the dark blue, Frank, did you have an update? That's the most limited, so do not wait. Oh, they are dynamite. Just cool, hip, dynamite. So fun. A 515-543. This is a, t this is the, um, what did we, what did I say earlier? This is the something for Joe something moment. For Joe. I like that. Yeah, you we know need, what? We need like a rolling. The Joes deserve a little something. <laughs> Oh, the Joes. The Joes. Do we have a male model for this? Anybody want to volunteer? I can um, go get Frank. my husband. He's upstairs. <laughs> Come on. Bill, Frank, anyone? Um, I love it. Okay, so we're going to open the box and reveal our something for the guy. These are